Police Chief Martin Flatley not only apologized here, he's been suspended for more than 70 days without pay since that investigation into the party. In addition to that apology tonight, he also took responsibility for actions he says eroded the public's trust in this town's police department. I apologize to the town of South Hold and fully accept the responsibility. An apology tonight from South Hold Police Chief Martin Flatley, delivered to town board members and the people of South Hold at a special meeting called to decide whether Flatley would be reinstated as chief. I apologize to all the residents of the town and in particular to the residents who called 911 or the police department to register a complaint regarding activities associated with the retirement party. It deserved a professional response from our department, which they did not receive. Flatley has been suspended without pay since August 12th of 2022. The suspension coming in the midst of a two year investigation into the police department's handling of complaints over a retirement party in Kutchog held during the height of the pandemic when gatherings of more than 10 people were not allowed. Going forward, I will ensure that this type of activity will never occur again under my leadership and I will work to restore the trust and relationship that all South Town residents deserve to have with their police department. Tonight, the town board voted to approve a settlement with Chief Flatley, resolving the disciplinary proceedings against him as long as the chief agrees to certain conditions, including a letter of reprimand that will always be in his personnel file. Flatley must release a letter of apology to the public, and he agrees to retire, effective June 24th, 2024. I want it behind us. I'm glad that it, it is and I just want to move forward. It's, it's time to really just focus on the future. Now the town supervisor tells me that Chief Flatley will be restored to duty once all of the conditions of the agreement are met. Doug? Tama, we know that four other town employees were under investigation. Any word on uh, what the status of that is? Well, I asked the town supervisor about that, Doug, and he tells me that four other hearings are pending right now to consider disciplinary action against those employees. And he says because those hearings are pending, that's the reason that the town can't release the full report into the investigation over the department's response to that party.